looks like I'm facing uh, Mathsad from France. So it is Mathsad to offer the powers. We have a selection of five god powers and one hero. From looking at this very quickly, I recognize that Bia Eros ugh, is a a problematic matchup for uh, who was it for? It was for Eros that it was very tricky since he had to start on opposite sides of the board. Let me pick Bia, or do I pick Eros for the challenge? Because hmm. I don't know if I remember those statics. Uh, if this fails, I'm probably losing because Eros uh, can then be stronger. But if I am able to kill one of Eros' workers, then I win because Eros is left without a power. Okay, let me take Bia and uh, let me start. Uh, I don't remember. There's a worker here and the other one here or here. Uh, so this here. this way. Probably. I don't know. This will. This is a really tricky matchup, and if Eros places his workers incorrectly, he he loses immediately. So, for example, a worker in B1, I can already go here and fork uh, both workers. So now, yes, okay, I recall this position. I go from D1 to D2, which is a quite natural move, and I cover B2, I cover C2. I cover B4, I cover C5. If Eros comes here in the next move, C1, B1, then he is forked. He comes here, he is, he is also forked. So, is this already winning? So I come here, Eros cannot go to B2, C2, B4, C4. He loses immediately. If he goes to here with this worker, then I just go here and fork. If he goes here, then I go to the middle, fork. If he goes here, another fork over here or over here. If he goes to B1, another fork. Okay. So this is over just like that. So here you die immediately. Okay, <laughs> that's not even. Okay, probably game over, <laughs> but it will be still. Okay, so this will be a very short game. Yep, one of the shortest. That's it.